Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you the exact methods that I use to find expired and deleted domains that I use to build my money-making websites. So it's important to understand there are several different websites. I use expireddomains.net um, to find expired domains or domains that have not been renewed by the original owner. Now, why would we want an expired a domain? Well, many domains, many expired ones, not everyone, uh, certain ones will have all of the links built out already that we're looking for. So that means, let's say they're a real business, like a roofing company or a home remodeling company, and they've, they, they had a Yelp listing and a Facebook listing and maybe a Google Map listing, and then they either changed domains or they went out of business most likely, and they didn't renew the $10 domain. For us, if we're building a site in that niche, having all of those links already existing, it gives us a huge head start in terms of how the algorithms are going to val validate our website. Um, I'm not against starting with, you know, dot infos, dollar ninety nine dot infos. I've had plenty of dot infos that have made me, you know, hundreds of thousands of dollars over the years. Uh, but I found I have more success using expired domains. So usually in my builds, if I'm pushing a twenty or twenty five site build, I'll I'll split it up. Um, maybe half expired half dot infos and uh, we, we go from there so in terms of expired domains um, I use expireddomains.net I simply go to deleted domains I go to filter I'm building one for a home remodeler so I'm just gonna do the word contractor I'd already done this search previously to make sure I can find the results I'm looking for to show everyone in this video so there's all these other things I, I, I burst over there's all these if you like a lot of people like majestic or uh, you know, in terms of uh, ranking of how good the site is, I, I used to mess with all this, but I now I just look for businesses that look like uh, legitimate businesses that once existed that then let their domain go. So contractor, I sort by BL that's backlinks because if it has no backlinks, there's really no benefit. Benefit. So um, we have an AceContractors.net. We can check this one out. So what we're gonna do? How do I check it out? I copy it. And a new window in Google, I search that domain with quotes. So just like that. And then I look to see. So it's still indexed, uh, acecontractors.net. So it's still indexed, which is a good, a, a good sign. Um, it's in the majestic million. Um, which don't worry about what that means. I don't see much more that I really like about it. It doesn't have a Yelp listing. I don't see a better business, a business listing. Um, I'm going to move on. Uh, icontractors.pl obviously not applicable Mayfield so sometimes I stay away from the location if it's in there um, so allstatecontractor.com we do the same thing search it in quotes citing now and when you see this it's spammy so we immediately move back on Alpha One Custom Contractors. Let's check them out. We're, we're looking for ones that had the whole suite of, um, they're called NAP, Name, Address, Phone, Listing. So Manta, Yelp, uh, Yellow Pages, Local Yahoo, all those things. So look at this. We've got Yellow Pages, Yellow Pages, Manta, Foursquare, Dex Knows, um, so this is a pretty decent one. I can check now in Namecheap. It's decent. It's not not in love with it. It's available. Uh, roofing contractor Sunrise. So Sunrise, this one was the one identified earlier. Is probably being the best one. We'll search that. So we've got Yelp. We've got Manta, we've got Compass, Yellow Pages, BBB, that's beautiful. And what I want to do is we got Buy to Yellow Pages or B to Yellow Pages. I want to make sure that link's in there. I don't care that it says it's not accredited. There's the link, Sunrise Contractors. And if I go to Namecheap, the domain should be available. I checked it earlier. And it's available for $8.88. So I think this is a sweet domain to start with. You can do any type of uh, contracting website on this. I'm going to show you in the uh, videos following this exactly how I 
use our plugin to build out a website and then how we mon how we get traffic and how we get it placed and then how we monetize that traffic but I can tell you these sites start to finish take minutes um, it's very very simple we can batch process you know we can do 10 in an afternoon no problem once you get your systems down and your templates all dialed in so that's how we find expired domains. They've been super successful for us um, ever since we've been doing it, probably about five, six years now. And uh, I hope you uh, had the same success doing it like we do. All right. See you in the next video.